alligators. Today's topic are pets and ESA, the emotional support animals. Remember to get your landlord's prior permission before you bring an animal onto the property. Check your lease for any fees like a pet fee or a pet deposit that may apply. And also look for any restrictions on the type of animal they can have as a pet. Now, if you have a legal pet or even a visiting animal for an hour or two, penalties may apply, so check your lease. Now, the law does allow you to have an emotional support animal, but you would have to get your pet qualified by a certified healthcare provider. They have to submit a letter and whatnot. If you do have an ESA, then there's no deposit or fee that would be required. Um, your roommate may have some say as to whether or not you have a pet, and if your pet is causing damages or noise, then they can be removed from the property. If you have any questions, please come see us at studentlegalservices.ufl.edu.